Welcome to Central Valley Talk. I am your host, Vicki Campos, and this segment is brought to you by Vicki and Bina Photography. So this is our wedding show, and we are talking about weddings and um, what's new in the industry. But today we have a special guest, and his name is Zoyer Zindel, and he is with Trans Emotion. So welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank I'm you totally for me. loving your name. That's a very <laughs> beautiful name. So tell me a little bit about your name. How did you get your name? Well, I made it myself. Oh. Um, <laughs> I. Um, I, I, I legally changed my name to that, and I just really liked that it wasn't even a name. It was just a word that I made up, and it became my name, nice. so now it's a name. Yeah, do you get a lot of compliments? Because I love it. <laughs> I get very I, I actually was surprised. I did not expect all the compliments, really? but I will take them. Yeah, I bet. I'm like, that's a very nice name. And did were you inspired by something or someone? Or? Well, I, I had wrote a short play when I was in the 11th grade, and that was the character's name, so now it's my name. Awesome. Well, it's very beautiful. I'm really loving it so you are with trans emotion tell me a little bit about trans emotion i'm not very familiar with that trans emotion is a, a 501c3 um, tax exempt community benefit organization that offers outreach advocacy education and support uh, for the transgender community and their allies in fresno and surrounding areas we re we're starting to bud in visalia as well um, and so basically education uh, regarding the transgender community uh, and their allies is awesome. what we're about very nice awesome so i see also that you guys have a trans Gender Day of Remembrance. So tell me about that. Absolutely. That was actually how our organization um, became, uh, okay. came to be, is we started planning this annual event and we still do it now. Uh, it is a day to honor uh, transgender individuals um, who we've lost uh, due to murder or suicide. Oh. Uh, and this is an international recognized day and Fresno's will be on November 20th. Nice, and where's that gonna be held? It's gonna be held at the Big Red Church, also known as First Congregational Church of Fresno. I believe that's the proper name. Yeah. First Congregational Church of Fresno, uh, which is at 2131 North Van Ness. It's off of Van Ness and Weldon. Nice, and what does your uh, service looks look like or what, what will happen in that day? Um, at the Transgender Day of Remembrance, we are going to have um, uh, inspirational speakers, live entertainment, poetry, uh, spoken nice. word readings. Um, we're also going to have art on display uh, re re in relation to the theme of transgender. We are also going to have a memorial in which, uh, which time we'll read the names of all nice. the transgender people who unfortunately passed away this year due to murder or suicide. So this is just a day for us to honor um, those transgender individuals who unfortunately are no longer with us and also to spread awareness about uh, violence and hate and and prejudice against the transgender community in hopes that we can create a safer and warmer community nice very nice well that's awesome that you're able to put an event like this you know for for our community again it's su Sunday November 20th uh, at 530 okay and you said it's at the red big the big church? red church oh, the big red church big red church <laughs> first congregational church of Fresno the flyers there and awesome. uh, really hope everybody can can attend and anyone can attend anyone can t attend this is all ages uh, there will be a portion where and when, it, when there's some heavy moments we have uh, provision set up for the youngsters to uh, be occupied with other things that's very very nice. Thank you for doing that. That's very awesome. That someone yeah. is taking the time to actually remember those who we've lost. Right, right. Light refreshments. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Nobody wants to skip out on a light refreshment. <laughs> right. The event will be inside if, if yeah. that if that encourages very folks nice. to come. But and is that traditionally when you guys have your your day of remembrance on usually like no, in November? November twentieth is the actual day. Nice. Um, so we're we are um, holding it on the day that it is recognized internationally yes. <coughs> and also light, light refreshments provided also we will have some uh, crisis resources tabling available nice very very good I'm, I'm very excited about that so um, is there anything anything else you'd like to share in regards to trans emotion or yes yeah. um, just a f two days before the event on the 18th 
at, at Friday, November 18th at 7 p.m. at the LGBT Center, 1067 North Van North Fulton. We will have a transgender march, a march to uh, bring awareness to the Transgender Day of Remembrance. Again, that will be Friday, November 18th, 7 p.m. at the LGBT Center, 1067 North Fulton. And we will do a sidewalk march through uh, the Tower District. We'll end up at the theater and hear some speakers and, and, and have some candles. That's very nice. Well, hope you guys can make it. If you're not doing anything on November 20th, go out and support. So thank you for being on the show. I no, really thank appreciate you. it. Thank That's you. very I, nice. I can't thank you enough. Yeah, so thank if there's you. anything else, um, how can someone reach you if they had some questions or had further questions in regards to the event or wanted to be part of the event well, or even volunteer that day? Sure. Um, an easy way to find us is through Facebook. Um, you can... Um, search in the search bar for trans emotion we will pop up as we have an organization page you can also reach us at 559-464-5806 again that's 464-5806 we can also be reached at trans emotion at gmail.com Zoyer with the beautiful name. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for being on the show. Sure, we really appreciate sure. it. And um, remember, November twentieth is the Transgender Day of Remembrance. Thank so you. thank you for being on the show. We really appreciate no it. Problem. Uh, this show was brought to you by Central Valley Talk and uh, Vicky and being a photography. Thank you so much. Yeah.